Hi, it's Sorka back again for Flirt. Um, I hope your week has been going well and that you have a great weekend coming up. This is my kitten Parker making a little cameo in this video, which I wanted to talk about today was um, why Miley Cyrus is such a big flirt in our sense of the word flirt. Um, there's a lot about her that she's done in probably the last year that have just made her really a good friend to um, all people, um, particularly women, LGBT, the homeless, and those less fortunate than herself, which is really commendable for a celebrity to do. Anyway, here I've got just six reasons why you should love Miley as much as I do. I've loved her since the beginning. Um, my mom used to change my diapers to Achy Breaky Heart by her dad. That was my baby song. So, um, the Cyruses have been a part of my life for a while, and um, here's a reason, six reasons why you should love her too. First of all, she started the Happy Hippie Foundation, which is specifically um, gauged towards helping LGBT youth and homeless youth. Um, and, and basically any vulnerable youth. And on her website it says stuff like, um, stop pointless judgment and you're only truly happy if you're making other people happy. And those are both wonderful things and I really appreciate that she looks out for homeless and LGBT youth, but also vulnerable youth. Um, because I think that covers a lot of people who might not identify as LGBT or homeless. Um, another reason why she is a great flirt is um, her fluid sexuality. Um, she's really a role model for um, sexuality and the whole idea of fluidity. Um, she kind of believes in having relationships with people who are of legal age and consent and are human. Um, and she recently said that she came out to her mom at her super young age saying, I love women the same way I like men. And I think that's really cool. She says love no, doesn't, she doesn't want labels and she's not hiding, but um, just that simple thing. She loves girls like she loves boys. Um, it should be that simple all the time. And that's awesome that her mom was so supportive of her and the fact that she's taking a stand for who she is and what she believes about herself. And um, she's just a great role model for sexuality. Um, Third of all, recently she did a paper magazine shoot, which is fantastic, beautiful colors. Um, she's nude, and um, but it just she looks real and raw. And um, she commended the photographers and the editors for not removing her armpit hair. Way to go, homegirl! Um, you don't need to remove that hair if you don't want to. Um, and it's just a really awesome natural look. So I highly recommend taking a look at those pictures. They're gorgeous, they're fun. She has like neon paint all over her. She is just an incredible artist and um, her body is a work of art because of the tattoo work she's had done. So you see a lot of her tattoos, which is cool. Um, number four, her voice, her talent. Like, let's be honest. You know, you might not have liked Hannah Montana, but that girl can sing. She has got it. Um, her, her next album she's saying is going to be on her terms. Um, and whether or not you like the music video, Wrecking Ball was, wow, raw. Um, I cried. It was so intense and talk about, again, a vulnerability that she really put out there after presumably her huge, um, breakup with Liam Hemsworth. Um, that music video is eye-opening but the lyrics themselves are really touching and even from the beginning her Hannah Montana nobody's perfect the climb um you know we can't stop is just a fun one but you know she really does her own thing and it looks like she's continuing to push that further um number five she's a strong independent woman um on uh, May 15th, she told Time Magazine that she's finally okay with being alone, which is really hard to do. Like, she and I are the same age. We're both 22 years old. Um, and it's hard to accept being alone, especially in the media spotlight, um, especially after already having been engaged for three years. 
um, kudos to Riley for um, accepting that. Before you can truly find love, you have to love yourself and be happy with yourself alone. Um, she's saying her future doesn't rely on a partner necessarily. And I just think that's awesome that she's um, being a role model for being an independent woman by herself. And finally, she is just a feminist. She identifies as one. She tells women, don't be afraid of anything. Do whatever you want. She describes herself as loud and funny and not typically beautiful, but she truly believes in equality for everyone. She told Huffington Post and she wants to be a part of this evolution towards equality for everyone. So, um, Miley, keep on keeping on. Please check out Fleur Magazine if you look at this. If Miley, if you're watching this, like, I'm just gonna die. But, um, check out Miley's um, new song. There's a rumor that there it's out there. Um, and support the homegirl. Check out the Happy Hippie Foundation. Check out her Twitter. She tweets about it all the time. Um, Miley, love you. Keep being a flirt. Have a good weekend, you guys.